What is up guys, we're here back again with another Division 2 video. Welcome back to Day video guys. This is me playing Conflict. Yeah, I am not the best PvPer, but I thought let's do something which is different from the norm. Let's go to PvP, let's slap on a build and see how it fares. And again guys, I am no PvPer, but I did enjoy my experience with doing some PvP. Now guys, yeah, if you enjoy the video, you know what to do, thumbs do it all it helps. And of course, if you're new to the channel and you're enjoying the content, please consider subscribing by dropping the woo bomb on the sub button. Ding the bell to be notified when I upload my shizzle. Guys, let's move this. Peeps, yeah, I want to talk a little bit about PvP. And I've done a little bit in the last couple of days. And to see how how good PvP can be. Now, I've slapped on a PvP build. If you want to see it, let me know in the comments section. And I'll do a little video. Guys, as I said, I'm not a big PvP here. So it's perhaps not the best build in the world. But it worked for me a little bit. And you can see I did get a couple of kills here and there. So I was quite ecstatic with that. So... PvP. Now, you know, there's a lot of rumours about what's happening with new updates, new seasons, what's happening next year, yada yada yada. We know there's been a lot of content creation videos out there if you just search. I'm not doing anything like that because, you know, I I'm going to talk about stuff when it's concrete and when it's there in the public domain so people can see. And I get it's very, very slow, quiet times for content creators playing the Division 2. So, I thought. Rather than speculate, let's go into the DZ. Let's go into conflict and see how I fare. Do I still have these silky skills from Division 1? And the answer is no, I do not. They have evaded me. They have eluded me, but I'm going to give it a go. I'm going to play a bit more PvP in the future because I do enjoy killing other agents. Yeah, however that may sound. One thing I've noticed that armor is key. Armor is essential. Now, if you roll with a whole full DPS build, I've noticed you'll be melted very, very quickly. So, survivability is key. So, getting that armor stacked up is key. And I've also noticed a lot of people running with shields. Guys, yes, that's why I'm rolling with a shield. I have to con just, again, conform to the norm. And that is go with that nice little shield, which is paper thin, but still, it gives me an extra second or two, a little bit of survivability, but it is what it is. But guys, yes, PvP, I do feel that in the long run, there needs to be some changes with PvP. It is what it is. It's fun. It, it is. And to be honest, once I did play a lot of PvP, I got really into it. I got really, really involved with the content, with some conflict. I went in the DZ for about three hours. I farmed. I killed a couple of rogues. I got killed a couple of times. Extracted safely. And again, it is a fun experience. But I do feel in a group, it is absolutely stellar. And it's a good place to be. Solo, maybe not in all fairness. But I'm enjoying my time in PvP. And the one thing I did, I initially took my Eagle Bearer. Yes, that Eagle gun that you can get from the Dark Hours raid. I do have one and I want to say thank you so much to my awesome clan mates who took me through dark hours and it was a doddle in all fairness but again upon doing so one of the guys squinty pigs i thank you so much my man for dropping the eagle gun thank you mate thank you in abundance i used that a little bit in pve and it quickly developed a space in my stash i thought i'd take it into pvp and again very quickly it developed a space in my stash not really a fan, even with the extra ammo, 60 in the mag, it just didn't do it for me. It's a shame, it's a crying shame. I went for, yes guys, you're going to go, no, don't go for that, it's a cheesy shit weapon, that is the G36C, which I did enjoy rolling with, and it's some kills. So, it works very nicely, that is God roll with, yes, drained on Boost. the but awesome source. And trying to stack up as much crit damage as possible. But all in all, I just want to say, I just want to reiterate... I've had a lot of fun in PvP. If you want to see some PvP content, other than just me running around um, and looking quite dapper at time to time, if you want to see some actual PvP content, some DZ, some farming, any kind of stuff, let me know in the comments section. I'd love to hear your thoughts and opinions. Just also, I'd like to hear your your thoughts on the state of PvP. As I said, I used to be a hardcore PvP division guy. I would spend 99% of my time in the DZ. Farming, where it be four players, where it be four rogues, I would go out, or even loot guys, even loot. I'd get all my loot pretty much from the DZ. Now, for me, Division 2, I've completely been bipolar opposite. I've spent 99% of my time in 
PvE content and then when it comes to PvP I've always refrained because I've not really enjoyed it. I've really struggled with PvP in this game. But I do feel that there is, you know, there is possibility that I could go back and really enjoy some PvP in a group or with clan mates. We could have a barrel of laughs. But what I want to know guys is, do you want to see some PvP from me? Do you want to see some PvP builds? And guys, please know, I am no expert in this field, in this game, but I do have a lot of fun. And that's what I'll deliver for PvP, some nice fun builds, utilising some decent weapons. Let me know what you think in the comment section guys, as always, I love your thoughts and opinions. And of course guys, of course, if you enjoyed the video, thumbs doodle, and I'll see you in the next one.